Today I want to show you how you can make some really simple graduation cap cupcakes to celebrate your child's graduation this year while in quarantine. My own daughter is graduating from high school this year and it is heartbreaking to know that there won't be a graduation. Schools are thinking maybe of doing a graduation in the fall, but I'm not going to count on it because we don't know what's going to happen with the pandemic. So I wanted to show you some cupcakes that I did for my daughter's grade eight graduation that you can easily make at home for your own child to celebrate their graduation, whether they're graduating from kindergarten, elementary school, high school, college, or university. It is important that we celebrate these milestones with our children because they've worked hard and they deserve to be appreciated. So take a look at these graduation cap cupcakes. They're super simple to make and I'm going to leave all of the links to the different recipes that you're going to need to have in order to make these in the description below so you can make all of this from scratch at home. So the base of these graduation cap cupcakes are my vanilla sponge cake recipe and I've put together a video for you of how to make vanilla sponge cake cupcakes in this video here which you can find the link to in the description below. So you bake these first and then you want to make some yummy buttercream icing. Now in our house we absolutely love mocha buttercream icing so I've got a recipe right here where you can see how to make your mocha buttercream icing and if your child is not into the coffee flavor no worries you can substitute the coffee flavoring for whatever your child's favorite flavor is. So it's super simple super easy recipe especially to do at home right now. So once you have your cupcakes and your mocha icing or whatever buttercream icing you want to top your cupcakes with, then we also want to make some homemade marshmallow fondant, which I will show you how to make in this video here, so that you can create some fun graduation caps to put on top of the cupcakes. You could also do a scroll, the diploma scroll, or you could do a, a gown, whatever your creative nature is. But I wanted to do something really simple to help you celebrate your child's graduation and not have to stress about it. So take a look at this, it's really simple. All I did after I made the homemade marshmallow fondant, which again, you can see in this recipe here, I just cut out little squares and placed them on top. So the way it worked is I created, I made the cupcakes and then I took a piping bag with the mocha buttercream icing and I swirled it on top. Now if you don't have an icing bag, I have a video that I created right here of how you can have alternative icing bags so it makes it a lot easier to do from home without having to spend a lot of money. You could simply take a Ziploc bag and fill it with your buttercream icing and snip a little corner off the end and then use that to make a nice round swirl on top of your cupcakes. Super simple. And then with the homemade marshmallow fondant, cut little squares. That's gonna be the square of the graduation cap. And you simply place that on top as well. Now, I painted these before putting them on the cupcakes. So the way I recommend to do this is make your marshmallow fondant, then let that sit for a bit so it stiffens up a little bit, roll it out so you have a nice flat surface. And then just take a knife and cut lines one way and lines another way to create little squares. Then I also took the leftover, the edges, rolled that up again and created little round circles that I pushed on top of each square to represent the little button on the top of the cats that holds the tassel in place. And to make the tassels, I just rolled marshmallow fondant into thin strips and then place two strips next to each other and simply lightly roll them together to create that spiral effect. Really simple and I painted the caps and the buttons with a purple because you just go with whatever school colors your child's school is that they're graduating from. And then I made the tassels silver. I happen to have some silver luster dust that I could create an icing out of or an icing paint out of but go with whatever you have on hand. Make sure everything you use obviously is edible. Again, I'll put a list to all of the different recipes that you're gonna need. So this vanilla sponge cake recipe, the buttercream icing recipe, and also the homemade marshmallow fondant recipe. I've got all of them down in the description below. They hardly use any ingredients at all. It'll be very cost effective, but more importantly, it'll be a fun way that you can celebrate your child's graduation 
you could have them make it with you to really be part of the celebration and then just have your own little graduation march at home and present them with a cupcake to honor them for their hard work. Again, a simple way to celebrate your child's graduation this year. And if you happen to have any of those little silver balls, dragées, then I just sprinkled them around to make it a little bit more exciting. All right, I hope you really found that helpful. You can check out the mocha buttercream icing up here, how to make the marshmallow fondant over here, or you can download the recipe and I'll put a link in the description below for you. I'll see you over here.